Every update we get the same question. Is this unit mage or is this unit punch? Well, today we're going to answer if the brand new cosmic unit Kirito is a mage or punch unit. Let's get right into the video. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Stop the video. Do you see this? 84.4% of you are not subscribed. Subscribe, please. Welcome back, guys, to another video of Anime Champions. And like I said, in this video, we are going to be looking and examining the brand new Cosmic Kirito to determine if he is a punch or mage unit. Uh, disclaimer, before the video starts, it doesn't really matter what you use him. Um, depending on what build you go for him, you will only get like a slight increase of uh, damage or decrease. So in the end, it doesn't really matter. However, um, I did do some testing to show those slight increase and decreases with certain builds in the game. So if you are interested, uh, please like this uh, video and subscribe if you are new. And without any further ado, let's get right into the result. All right, you guys can see in the screen right now. So this was done with just one Kirito at a time, max level and best stats. Um, for the mage build, I had the ult fully charged and then I started attacking the boss. All of these was done on the boss, the Heathcliff boss on SOA. So the first build we tested was a warrior build of Boxer Celestial. It beat the boss in 28.83 seconds with an average DPS of 110. This is uh, one of the fastest times, if not tied actually for the fastest times. And it's a pretty solid build. Next up we have a Boxer and Titan which killed it a little bit slower because as you can see it has a less average DPS which makes sense. So if you are going for a Boxer build at least on a boss you probably want uh, if you, basically Titan Boxer will give you more on NPCs uh, but on bosses um, Boxer Celestial will give you more that's pretty much how it works. Now for the mage builds, we have first up Crimson and Titan. It beat it in 40 seconds. However, it did a lot of its peak damage like compared to this one. So um, like it does more peak damage when it does burst, but because it has a slow all time, it takes a little bit to get its ult charge again. And now on the other side, Crimson Black Hole, which charges ult very fast. It does less peak damage, but because it can charge faster and faster and faster than compared to these other two, um, basically, it does almost the same time as this warrior build. So, it, does this mean Crimson Black Hole is better than uh, Crimson Titan? Or is it better than Boxer Celestial? No, not really. Because this one has a lower peak damage compared to uh, these two. However, um, it has a faster ult time, so it kind of evens out. So if you want to kill things quickly, you want to go for something with like a higher peak damage. But if you want to kill something more tanky, uh, much faster, I guess you want to um, use a like, Crimson Black Hole. It, it's weird, guys. It, it's hard to explain, but that's basically how it plays out. And the last build I did was Crimson and Celestial, just so it had Celestial for the mage build, mage build as well. Second course, the side of the 